The LPGA Tour returns to New Jersey for the second time this season for the ShopRite LPGA Classic. Last month's Cybase Match Play Championship at Hamilton Farming Gladstone, New Somerset was the scene of the first visit to the Garden State. However, this week's event is just over 100 miles south of Gladstone in the town of Galloway, Atlantic City, where the Bay Course will play host to the eighth official LPGA Tournament of the Year. The ShopRite Classic was a mainstay of the LPGA Tour from 1986 to 2006, but took a brief break before returning to the calendar last year. Ai Miyazato took the spoils as she claimed the fourth of five LPGA wins during 2010. The Japanese star's two-shot victory over closest challengers Paula Kramer and South Korea's MJ He propelled her to number one in the Rolex rankings, a position she held for 11 weeks. This year has proved to be comparatively disappointing for Miyazato, though, with just one top ten finish to her name from six starts. Currently seventh in the world rankings, the 26-year-old will be hoping to be the first player in 2011 to successfully defend a title. If her putter runs hot again, she has to be a contender. Current world number two, Suzanne Pedersen, is the form player in a field which includes 97 of the LPGA's top 100 players on the money list. The Norwegian star beat Natalie Gulbis, Stacey Lewis, Yanni Seng, Na Yon Choi and Christy Kerr en route to winning last month's Cybase Match Play Championship. Pedersen continued that good form last week as she made the trip to Rio de Janeiro for the HSBC Brazil Cup. She finished 10th, and if she's over the jet lag, the five-time Solheim Cup player could be the one to watch. Paula Kramer also racked up the air miles as she jetted from Orlando to the UK for the inaugural Power Play Golf event at Celtic Manor. The reigning US Open champion teed it up alongside the likes of current US Open men's champion Graham McDowell and Ian Poulter and she entertained the crowds with a number of great shots as she played her way to a third place finish. With the defense of her US Open crown of Colorado Springs on the horizon, the nine-time LPGA winner has the chance to move back into the top 10 of the Rolex rankings with a good showing of Bay Courts. Yanni Seng, one of six different winners on tour this season, is the pick of the rest of the field. The world number one has not been in the best of form recently, and with Suzanne Pedersen close behind her in the Rolex rankings, the three-time major champion could certainly do with an improved display. The Bay Course has been known to produce repeat winners, so don't rule out Angela Stanford and other past champions like Christy Kerr and the two-time champion Julie Inkster, who won the very first ShopRite Classic back in 1986. With one and a half million dollars available in total prize money over the 54-hole tournament, expect there to be plenty of excitement. And don't forget, you can catch the best of the action here on GolfingWorld.tv. The LPGA Tour is about to kick off its summer swing in style in Atlantic City.